Hey Savanistas, Maria Loesch here with Savanista.com. Don't you hate it when you need a nail file or a safety pin or a hair rubber band and you're shuffling around in your purse and you can't find one? So then you turn to your girlfriend and you ask her, hey, you got a nail file? And she says, no. Well, that's a bummer. So I'm here to show you an easy and inexpensive solution to that very problem by creating your very own Savvy Purse Kit. So let's get started with the actual pouch that we're going to put our items in. Now this is very important ladies, the size is very important. I'm stressing a four by eight with one zipper. That way it can fit in most of your handbags and it's not heavy, it's lightweight. Clear is good if you want to, you know, see all, all your goodies in there. Or if you're into something a little more fancier, you can get, you know, something more decorative. These I got at Rite Aid for under six bucks, so that's pretty cheap. But, you know, you can go as high as you want, but I'm showing you a, a savvy and an expensive way to do it. Now let's get to some of the items. Now I'm going to plop them in the, the clear pouch so you can see. Uh, safety pins, hello. You can buy a box of these. You can find them at CVS or Rite Aid or one of those places or Target. There's a box of them and buy them and get a few and drop them in here. If you can't seem to find pins, then how about some fashion tape? Stylists use these. They actually really, really come in handy if you need to fix something on your wardrobe or your button pops off or something like that. It's kind of like double-sided sticky tape, but it's really easy to remove off your garments and it doesn't damage as well. So you can take a sheet out, stick it in here. Rubber bands, like I was talking about. This is really nifty I got at Sephora. They're the same color as my hair. They're snag-free and they come in this cool little, um, kind of like a matchbook style thing. Speaking of matchbook style stuff, these are little nail files in a little matchbook kind of case. There's, I think, 12 of them in here. They're mini little nail files, and this is by Tweezerman. Look, and they're cute. They're little polka dots, and you can put one in there, and then you got backup. You've got a whole case of these, so keep them aside and when you need them again. A mini lint roller. These come in very handy, especially if you have pets. Let's drop one of those in there. Um, and then... This is a new invention which I love and it's super groovy are these disposable toothbrushes. They have a little kind of toothbrush gel inside and then even a pick at the opposite end. There's two in a pack and I think they're like a dollar something. Hand sanitizers are a big deal. So I've got various options here. The one that's the most popular is the gel but I like this little spray one that I found at Whole Foods and it's a uh, all natural alcohol free. There's also the uh, towelette types as well. So whatever one, you know, floats your boat uh, or you can find, then, you know, we'll drop them in, in here as well. This is a different little thing. It's not antibacterial wipes. These are actual cleansing wipes for your face. So you know, you're running around all day, you're sweaty, your makeup's kind of, you know, falling down. You need to freshen up a bit. These are good. I also got this at Sephora, and these were $4, and there's 10 of them in here, so that's not too shabby. And then we've got hand cream. This is by Bliss, and I love Bliss hand cream. It's so super yummy. This one's $8. bucks. Um, my mom thinks that that's an outrageous price for a little hand purse cream. So you can find a travel size of any other brand at a Target or a Walmart for, you know, under $2. Now, last but not least, and this might be a little hard to find, so if I can find a link where to buy this, I will post it. This is a combo comb uh, hairbrush thing. They used to sell them at a local drugstore like a CVS or Rite Aid, but they don't anymore. They have some other different types of versions of these. And I really like this one. So guess where I found this? At a Chinese supermarket. So if you have a Chinese supermarket nearby, I bet you they'll have these and they're like usually a dollar. It's always good to have a brush or a comb. So if you happen to have a travel size brush or a comb, you can throw that in here. And that's it. That is your savvy purse kit. It's got all your items in. It's handy, it's lightweight. You can throw it in your bag like I'm going to do right now. Boom. 
doesn't add any extra weight and there you go.